Okay, so what's up guys, Lazy Neil here and today I'm going to make a very quick video. Basically, it's regarding this. This is nothing new by the way. This is my MI Revolve watch and I've been using this for, you know, just using it as a stopwatch and things like that. In my previous videos, you must have seen it. Uh, but if you notice, there's something wrong. Where are the straps? Where are they? And that's one of the most stupidest things which has happened to me at this point of time. So what happens is that uh, I've been using these rubber kind of straps. Uh, this is the original one, by the way, from MI. I have already replaced it with another rubber strap, but basically the same thing happens. What happens is that if you see over here, the rubber itself just tears apart and basically this metal thing just comes up and it keeps on tearing and then it you can basically just lose your, you know, your watch itself. So this has happened to me twice. So the original one this is the one it just broke off. The next one also, which I bought again, have the same issue. So it was practically useless buying these kind of bands. And also in time, if you don't use them, they become very sticky, which is very annoying too. So what's the solution for them? And that's what I have over here. Uh, this is nothing special, by the way. Uh, this is basically um, this kind of a metal band you get. So you get for around 573 at this point of time, but I got it for 430 rupees. Uh, again, the number just fluctuates right over there. And basically it's a metal band uh, with the black in color. You also get it in silver, I think, but this one is the black color variant. We could say matte black. So what I did was, or what the plan is exactly, is to basically put the metal strap for this guy and um, it should be good to go. So that's what I'm trying to do. So again, if you want this strap, I'll be linking it down in the description down below. Uh, you can check it out if you have the same issue like me, because these are plain garbage, simple as that. So let's do an unboxing. I'll be very frank with you all guys. I've already unboxed this previously. So this is just for your experience or for your unboxing experience. So yeah, <laughs> yep, that sucks, right? But uh, yeah, basically what is you get inside of it is you get this uh, strap over here, this metal one, and you get these two pins. Now these two pins are one of the worst things. I, I, I hate pins, by the way, like I genuinely do hate these pins, but uh, there's no other better alternative than these things. Okay, let me just keep this aside a bit and uh, let's go through these two things. Now, uh, I'm not going to be, you know, just going to be like, oh, like, you know, I'm just going to be putting it in. Uh, it's a little bit difficult, at least for me. It may be very simple for any other person, but for me, it's it's very difficult, I would say. But the the thing is that uh, before we put this in over here, I just want to give you an overview on what how exactly it looks. So the reviews itself are really good uh, for this one. The only thing is that they say that the metal itself or the not the metal itself, the color itself uh, comes out pretty easily but personally i'm not too much you know i i don't care as much because of the fact that you know it is much better than losing your watch itself because of this nonsense so for this what you need to do is basically uh you have this over here and you need to put this pin right over here uh, i would say a simple thing is to just go to a shop where they just do this for you because uh, you will also need to adjust the, uh, you know, the thing over here also. So that would be better, but uh, just a quicker. So basically what you need to do is this side, wherever this thing is that it should be on top. Okay. Not the other way around. So let's put this thing like this in and just press this. God damn it. That's why I hate it. By the way, I'm just going to put one of them. And maybe I'll just stop the video and just put the other and you'll have a better uh, time. Again, I don't want to waste anyone's time um, doing this stupid thing. So just put this in like this. I don't know if you can see it. But basically, you just need to press on this and then just, just, just hope that it connects. So if you see. It's pretty much connected. So the thing over here, just need to slide it in and then just hook it in. A similar thing over here. Hopefully it happens as quickly as the previous one. Because the first time when I did this, um, I literally spent literally 12 minutes doing this nonsense. 
uh, hopefully this time it's going to be much better so just put this in like this and this is what happens i i, I genuinely <laughs> hate this i genuinely genuinely hate this but yeah let's go and there we freaking come on man if this doesn't happen within another two to three tries uh, i'm just gonna cut this video and uh, you will see it in action so hopefully last try come on there we go cool so there we have it it looks really nice really cool uh it, it does increase the weight of the watch itself so um that's that but again it's metal at the end of the day rather than rubber uh so let me just wear it right now for you guys so here we go i have a little bit of a bigger hand so it looks something like this the band looks something like this there's still a good amount of play over here so i will need to definitely go to a shop and just you know uh decrease the things a bit so they just remove one of these things and make it a bit more tighter because at this point of time it's very loose so it literally reaches over here so that's pretty stupid so that's basically it guys uh what are my final thoughts on this first of all the band itself is really good it's matte finish black color uh you can expect the color to come out from the edges that's very much expected over here uh but if you care if you use this kind of nonsense which breaks over here i would suggest just to buy this uh, and also you can use this for you know any special occasions weddings things like that or even as a normal watch uh, these things don't suit as well on suits and things like that so yeah guys uh, that's my verdict pretty good for the price it's just 430 now it's around five so around 600 rupees you could say it's around 570 at this point of time if you see over here so 573 you can get some discounts currently the big billion day is going on so you can get some discounts on uh, credit cards and things like that so yeah guys this wraps it up guys thanks for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video bye for now